Dear loved ones, this is RPA from Dubai. Today, the date is 2nd February 2020 or 0202 Today is a important date and it is one of the opening of major gateway to the higher dimensions. So today's meditation will give you extraordinary benefit. And it will lead you to experience the higher level of spiritual activities within yourself. Today's message is mainly to address an issue, current issue. I am getting a lot of messages regarding coronavirus, and it is a report in many countries. It has already been declared when one of the international emergency by World Health Organizations and other international bodies. So this message is just to address that, that what is happening. During my New Year message, I explained that in this year, your fear will be tested to the limits. A lot of fear will surface. Fear of losing everything. And this kind of virus epidemic is one of that. These will challenge you and make you fearful. And this is one of them. There are many types I already explained in that voice message that a lot of natural calamities will increase. A lot of political disturbances will come. And also I mentioned there that political disturbances will increase because of something called responsibility crisis. That no one is willing to take the responsibility of what they have done or what has been done on the climate, on humanity, etc., etc. So that will lead to another chaos. Anyway, the way out I suggested to be on the spiritual path, to center yourself. This is a very good time to redefine yourself. The fear will be generated by the external events for sure. But at one point of time, some power will come from within and that power will transform yourself. Now, regarding this virus and other effects, let me tell you one thing. 
they have contacted me personally i already told them if you are practicing kriya regularly and your pvf is high no virus will do any harm to you all these kind of things they cannot work if your cellular vibrancy is high and i have already given example in workshops and different places that to get rid of any kind of toxin or any kind of attack is just to make your vibration high the similar way we clean a jewelry i normally give an example that an old jewelry need to the dart need to be clean i put it in ultrasonic bath in high frequency the darts already come out into the water and the jewelry become clean same technique is applicable here just you have to maintain your high vibration and you have to continue practice your spiritual techniques what you learned already if you do that then what will happen let me give you few some glimpses of that what are the possibilities when you walk the path of the spirituality and and this time your heart will open up to the new ways to lead you you will follow your passion you will get some kind of activities will be your passion it about passion is love in action like some work you love to do that will come to you and that will be very fulfilling to you optimism will come in your life this optimism will come out of out of some behavioral change where you don't hold any judgment about anything or anyone some of you will experience a dimensional separation dimensional separation means that what is happening around you it is no longer affecting you you are in a different dimension you are always at peace internally you are not easily moved or reacting to anything coming from outside you can if you check what you used to do in similar situation say 5 years back and you are doing it now you will realize what i am talking about these are the signs of elevation it will come some of you will experience that you are separated from time earlier you used to rush yourself with the time you have to maintain time you have to do things timely manner and rushing completion of something you got worried and tensed and thing like that you will realize that time is no longer affecting you that way anymore again to check see what you used to do about time few years back and what you do now your internally how you respond to time you yourself will be surprised that how the internal change has already happened within you
the way you treat people will change. You will lose interest in whatever they are doing or saying or how you will be seen as others really doesn't matter. You will realize that there is no need to show off anything. It really doesn't matter. You already learned that earlier what used to show off hardly doesn't matter. Say earlier you have say taken, I'm just giving for an example. You have to throw a big party, say. Now you realize it really doesn't matter. Nobody remembered what party you have thrown. Or maybe you have taken a very luxurious house, thinking that people will come and appreciate it later, and it is like a prestige issue. Later on, you realized last five years, hardly, you know, six people visited at different times. That's all. There is no value added to you socially. List is, list is big, but the realization will come that whatever you are earlier used to bring value, now they are not bringing that value. It is not about that external factors that is really make the difference. It is your state, internal state, that allow you to enjoy life. Nothing outside gives that, that kind of happiness anymore, or you get disillusioned that maybe a few times, one or two times, but it is it doesn't last. Maybe sometimes you are happy to pay for in a restaurant and pay for others and feel happy about it, that you are feeding others so you are rich. And after some time, after several such incidences, maybe after two, three years, four years, five years, you realize that you have taken for granted. Everybody assumes that you will pay. <laughs> there is no credit anymore. Anyway, so you, you got what I mean to say. So those happiness, that wish to bring happiness, no longer will bring you happiness. That same thing. Ultimately, you landed up on yourself. So it makes sense to now work on yourself. And just empower yourself all the spiritual tools you have, this will last forever. This power will not leave you because it is unconditional. It does not depend on something, your status or your intelligence or ability to income, etc., etc. And when we surrender ourselves to our own higher self, higher power, then our life gets completely transformed. And then we lead a life of never-ending joy and full of bliss. With this, I will close this voice message. Om Mangalam.